Hey, this is Brett, and this 2022 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Limited Level 1 is stock number 13971Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck and Ram headquarters. This 2022 Ram 2500 has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine. It's paired up with the six speed 68 RFE automatic transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. And uh, this one has a max towing capacity of 18,461 pounds and a max payload of 1,980 pounds. Found those numbers on Ram's tow guide website. I will link it in the description below. I'm gonna go all the way around in the video, inside, underneath, start it up and take a look under the hood, give you the most accurate representation possible. Bright white clear coat is the color and I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash Summit Auto. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube and truck walkarounds for that matter. 8,000 videos and counting. This one comes with the 20 inch gloss black painted alloy wheels and it has Mickey Thompson Baja Legend MTZ tires. These are LT295 60R20s. I would say they have 70 to 80 percent of the tread left on them. Very good tread on those tires. Frame and underbody is exceptionally clean on this truck. This is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Maine. You get the LED headlamps, LED running lights, and the LED fog lamps, all part of that um, limited level one package. Front bumper's in excellent shape. I didn't see any dents, dings, scuffs, or scrapes, or rock chips. You get the gloss black grill. My guess would be that this is a night edition as well. The hood is in excellent shape. I didn't see any dents or dings on that. And the passenger side front fender is in great shape as well. Passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. Looks really good. And as you go down this side of this 2022 Ram 2500, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the truck, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have the confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at. So that you can make the smart buying decision from wherever you're at, or make the decision to come take a look at the truck. And if this video helps you make that decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Back wheel is in excellent shape as well, and the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires even, I would say maybe even a little bit more than the front tires. Frame and underbody, once again, very nice and clean, has all the remaining factory exhaust, so it hasn't been altered in any way, shape, or form. And this one does come with the power running boards. I'll show you that this side is working. Now those are the factory running boards. Fender flares, LED tail lamps, painted rear bumper, no dents or dings on that, looks really good backup parking sensors, and of course the full towing package, which includes a receiver hitch, uh, seven pin wiring. This is for um, your trailer backup assist system. And then you have a hookup for an auxiliary camera for a trailer. Tailgate is in fantastic condition as well. Note you get the blacked out four x four Ram and limited logos on there. Has the power drop down tailgate. Very nice spray and bed liner. You get LED bed lights back here, uh, 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in. You can turn these lights on and off with the button and you get some nice side box tie downs and you also get a very nice decked toolbox. Spray and bed liner goes onto the tailgate and that shots, shuts nice and solidly. Coming around the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no dents or dings on there and for full Disclosure, this back wheel just as nice as the rest. Looks really good. Cab and doors on the driver's side are in fantastic shape. Has the enter and go system, heated fold up mirrors, blind spot monitoring, built in directional signals, LED side lights, and uh, the 360 camera. These fold up like so, they also fold in like that. Inside, the limited level one package gives you the black leather bucket seats. Now the one thing that the limited package gives you is uh, the full leather 
Even the bolsters are leather, like the Laramie package will give you the suede inserts, but these are all leather. You get the gray piping on there as well. Heated and cooled seats, both these seats are powered, driver's side lumbar, factory all-weather floor mats, auto headlamps, power pedals, power windows, locks, and mirrors, memory driver seat, and these mirrors do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so you know that both sides are working properly. You also get blind spot mirror, power blind spot mirror. If you look at that outside mirror, you can see that is moving, which is really nice, especially for the passenger side to adjust that while you're sitting in the driver's seat. Back seats are just as clean as the front seats. These are heated on the outboard side. Power side and rear window with the built-in rear defrost, no rips or tears on these seats, really nice condition. Uh, the headliner's in great shape. You get the speakers in the ceiling, part of that Harman Kardon sound system. You get storage underneath there. You also get a load floor, which is nice. You got muddy boots or tools, put them on there. You're not gonna get your seats dirty. Or if you got pets, put both sides down. They got a nice flat place to lay. And once again, they're not gonna get your seats dirty or wreck them. Back here, you get in-floor storage with removable bins for easy cleaning. You can put ice and drinks in there. And it's like you have too many coolers wherever you go. Or if you're not in Wisconsin, just extra storage space. Heated seat buttons, two USBs, two USB-Cs, then 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in. Get the child safety locks in the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look really good on this truck. Let me show you the VIN sticker here as well as the tire loading, tire and loading information sticker. Once again, 18,461 tow capacity and 1,980 payload capacity. And also no Canadian trucks here. Take a look inside, you get the limited package, uh, limited animation at the beginning there. Digital speedometer, instrument cluster is very nice and clean on that seven inch LCD display. You get a time display battery voltage, oil, or a water temperature range to empty. And you can change those corners to read whatever you want. So that's pretty cool. Comes with the heated wood grain trim on the top here, leather wrapped. You get a little wood grain insert on the bottom of the steering wheel there as well. Um, cruise controls, adaptive cruise controls, gear selector, Bluetooth and information center controls, audio controls in the back of the steering wheel. Uh, your shifter for the six speed 68 RFE automatic transmission push button four wheel drive. This one comes with the Uconnect 5 12 inch radio. So you get your climate controls here, heated cooled seat buttons, heated steering wheel controls. You have AM, FM, and uh, Sirius XM radio capabilities. If you go to sources there, there's Sirius, um, and then all your hookups, of course. And then this one does have the factory navigation system. There is Highway 41, so that is working nicely. And lastly, you get all your different apps in here. And then I'll turn it on so we can check out the surround camera, which is pretty sweet. So there is your surround view on the camera. You get a backup cam, a narrow view, a wide view of the back, a wide view of the front, a narrow view of the front, and then you can check out your cargo cam which you can only really see what's going on in the deck toolbox. Um, but this is my favorite camera on all the Rams. You can look down the side, this is part of the tow technology group, and you can see where you're backing up your camper or boat or trailer. Uh, that would just be awesome backing up my camper. I wish my truck had this option in particular. But anyways, uh, you can also check out your backup cam and then zoom in on the receiver hitch get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer first time every time lane departure warning stability control there's your harman kardon badge you also get the rear view mirror camera so it's an actual video display of what's going on behind you don't like it want in a normal rear view mirror you can make that happen as well so down here is your factory brake controller your um, alternate trailer height. So this one has the rear airbag suspension. If you got different um, weighted trailers, you can program two different trailers so that your truck will either raise or lower, lower uh, depending on the trailer height and um, weight. Tow haul mode, factory exhaust brake, front and rear parking sensors. You get six auxiliary upfit switches, two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an aux jack and the wireless cell phone charge pad. You also get a 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in, keyless entry with remote start on here. And then you get cup holders and coin tray 
right there as well. You get the limited badge on that center console armrest. Uh, passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well. No rips or tears on there. And then you do get the power sunroof, which is a really nice feature to have as well. Assist and SOS buttons, map lights, power drop down tailgate button, sunroof controls, as well as rear window controls and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. We'll start it up, take a look in the hood. Also check out all those LED lights in the front. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. You can see that step bar is working nicely too. Also the LED side lights. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, and of course cleanliness of this truck all the way around, inside and out. I didn't see a single dent or ding on it. LED lights, all very nice and bright. Cab lights are working nicely as well. Under the hood, we have the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this truck has been fully safety to end inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. There is the emissions sticker. And I would highly recommend this truck from a quality and condition standpoint. I like the look of the Baja, Mickey Thompson Baja tires, and it's just got a really nice stance, nicely loaded up, and just in absolutely perfect condition. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we gotta go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, You'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and specifically heavy duty truck walk arounds on YouTube. 8,000 videos and counting. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to more RAM 2500 truck videos I've done in the upper right. A link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2022 RAM 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Limited Level 1 in bright white clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.